Are you thinking about moving to Summerlin? This quick video is gonna go over the pros and cons about living in Summerlin. One of the first pros about living here in Summerlin, Nevada is the fact that it is a little cooler than the rest of the valley. So because Vegas kind of sits like a bowl, Summerlin being in the northwest part of the city, you are a little higher up elevation wise than the rest of the town. So it is a little cooler during the summertime and it does get a little chillier in the winter. And the second pro why you'll love Summerlin is downtown Summerlin. You've got food, entertainment, sporting events, you name it. This place has everything to offer. You have to come check it out. Speaking of food, there's so many choices here in downtown Summerlin. One of the cool places that I like to bring my daughter is MTO Cafe. We love to have lunch here. There's even a Maggiano's. She loves pasta, so we go there to eat. You can literally spend an entire day here at downtown Summerlin. And another pro about living in Summerlin, Las Vegas, is the fact that you've got some great sports that you can watch. Right behind me here, we have the Las Vegas Aviators, which is our minor league baseball team. And just on the other side of the stadium, you also have City National Arena, where the Golden Knights practice, and you can also get out and skate on the rink as well. And another pro about living in Summerlin is you have Red Rock Canyon in your backyard. If you enjoy the outdoors, this is a great change of pace from the hustle and bustle of the Las Vegas Strip. You can come out here, enjoy the outdoors, go mountain bike riding, you can go hiking, you've got horseback riding. There's tons of outdoor activities that you can enjoy and get away from the city. One of the cons about living in Summerlin is the fact that you're on the northwest part of the city. So to get to Henderson or the Southern Highlands, you're about 30 to 40 minutes away. So from Summerlin to McCarran, you're looking at about a 20 to 25 minute drive. Now keep in mind guys, if there's traffic, you may be able to add another 15 to 20 minutes on top of that. So if you frequently travel, you may want to consider other parts of town. For example, I travel quite a bit to California to see my daughter and I live in Southern Highlands and I can typically get to the airport in about 10 to 15 minutes. Another con about Summerlin, Nevada is our public transportation isn't quite the best. So you do need a vehicle to get around town. I personally live in Southern Highlands and it took me about 30 or so minutes to get out here today to shoot this video for you. So if you're planning on moving here, make sure to budget a car payment or be able to purchase a vehicle so you can get around town without any issues. Another con about living in Summerlin, Nevada is the cost of living. The median home price out here is about 420,000 compared to other parts of Las Vegas, which is about 270,000. So living in Summerlin is a little more expensive, especially when it comes to owning a home. But if you go back to our pros list, you have a ton of amenities that do make it worthwhile living in this part of town. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and we look forward to catching you on the next video.